a Toro walk behind mower, but this has personal pace. Let me show you what that means and give you a demo. Dave Taylor here, mowing my lawn, something I end up having to do about every week or so. Lucky I have this, which is the Toro 21 inch gas walk behind mower. And it has a lot of cool features, but what I'm really psyched about, and I've been using this for a while now, but what I'm really psyched about is something they call personal pace. And it's really pretty cool. So you see this is a metal handle, but this one actually slides up and down. And the further you push it in, the more the auto power will help move the mower forward. Now, it seems a little weird, but it turns out that it's actually really incredibly smart because if you're going downhill, it won't help at all. You'll just have you know, gravity pulling your mower down. But if you're going uphill, like I have in this little spot right here, then this I will naturally push and it will help the mower move upward. So basically, it's like a little magic trick that always lets the mower be the same resistance as you push it. Let me show you, and then we're gonna do a <laughs> mower eye view. So you can see the same thing happen. So first off, super easy to start. Pull the bar back, pull the handle. Easy enough. Now, to get it to go forward, I can either just push like a traditional mower, or I can use personal pace with the flex handle. So let's do that. And now I'm moving uphill with incredibly little work. And that's it. So. That's how a personal pace works. It's really pretty slick. Now, this mower has a bunch of really neat tricks to it, including smart stow, where you can fold it up and put it on its end. And it's what's known as a super recycler. So everything gets mulched down to basically nothing. So you notice I don't have a bag and I don't have dead grass clippings on my lawn, even though this is the mower I use for the lawn. So it basically cuts the grass so small that it just gets absorbed back in. It's really pretty sweet. You also never have to change the oil. What a tedious thing to have to change the oil on a mower. Blech. So this also features a 163cc engine and it is not incredibly expensive for something that's going to give you hopefully 10 or more years of mowing adventures, however big or small your lawn is. So let's go and show you that action footage. So what I did is I took an action cam and I taped it to the front of the mower. And so this is basically the mower's eye view. If the mower had its own AI, it would be seeing something like this as it cuts a lawn. <laughs> so a little crazy. I thought about having it even lower where the grass would push the um, actual camera lens, but I realized that if the camera actually disconnected from the mower, boom, it'd be all over and it'd be ugly. So that was a compromise. So pretty fun. I mean, it does a really nice job mowing. I'm really a fan of this. It is super reliable. It's super easy to start. The fact that I can just fold it up and stick it in a corner of my garage is fantastic. And it's a little spendy, but you know, like I said, if you're thinking of this as mowing for one summer, then it's crazy. But if you're thinking of five or 10 years of keeping your lawn or lawns, plural, beautiful, then it's entirely reasonable. So let me tell you the price, but before I get to the price, let me ask if you can subscribe to my channel, just click that red subscribe button. Really appreciate it. Great. Now, this is the Toro 21 inch gas walk behind mower and it will cost you $479. You can check it out at Toro.com or your favorite home supply or lawn care site. So with that, I'm gonna get back to my mowing, which means that I will, well, hang on, I'll catch you in my next video.